Hey, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's me, Austin 9988 here today, pleasuring your faces with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Type Force 3. And it's been a while. We haven't really visited this game in a while. Um, so I'm, I'm just really quickly, by the way, I'm just going to try to end the day quick to go on to Saturday. Um, and honestly, it's entirely my fault. Um, this should be coming out right after an update video which will pretty much explain what's been going on what i've been doing why exactly the um why exactly the videos haven't been coming up much as of late and if you are actually one of the people that's really committed to this series and really is curious why this series hasn't really been going on please do go take a look at that video but for the rest of you that just want to see me kick some ass in card games because that's totally what's going to happen. I never lose. I've never lost a game ever. Um, ever. And I never will. Because I'm the best. So, yeah. <laughs> anyway, we'll just jump straight in. So, I'm just coming in here. I'm collecting these cards. Because I don't think I've ever gotten them. I kind of want to fight Atticus. You know what? Haven't played the game in a bit. <laughs> Alright, so. First, first... First episode back in the game, after a while of not playing, let's jump into fighting quite possibly one of the hardest characters in the game, so let's just go. Let's just do it. Second to go, of course, always. Second to go is the best, because you... You literally get full control of the situation when you go second. In tag duels, it's kind of better to go first, because then you can set the stage, they can react, and then you can react to them. It's kind of weird. Tag duels kind of have the opposite thing. I don't know. It's entirely up to your playstyle, but in my personal opinion, it always works better doing this. I still have that weird glitch where the cards do that. If that card cannot, you know, that card might be a bit difficult to deal with. Hey, you know what? Let's just let's just play this. Special summon by sending three. Oh yeah, that one. <laughs> that might be difficult to get out there. Uh. Let's set this. I think that's a good card to just have set. And I think we're good for now. If we can get some equip spell cards out and summon Haman Lord of Striking Thunder, I think we can win this game pretty easily. Taking a swig of my Coke. Usually Pepsi, but today it's Coke because I felt like being different. Well, man, I activate this spell. Yeah, the cards are backwards in those animations. It's weird. I think it's just because when, um... Do I want to do it for that one? Not really. I don't think I really want to activate it for that one. Mm. No, let's not activate it for that one. We'll activate it on the second one, because the second one's easy to kill. This one will get killed. I take 1500, but that's not a problem. I can use it to special summon. Um, who do we want, though? Hmm. All warrior type monsters gain 400 attack. This card can attack twice during the same battle phase. That might be nice. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, maybe this one. This one might be a good one. We can clear his board with this. And then when he attacks with the second one. We can, uh, we can use Kunai with Chain just to switch it to defense. Both effects. How do you activate both effects? I want to just do this because I've never actually... Oh, you know what? Alright, well... You know, you know what? Alright, I'm fine with that. Uh, okay, this...
Hmm. We could start building up a board. I don't know. We could sort of revealing light play this guy. And then we could start really building up a board. I think I'm gonna do that. I think that might be the best option right now. Use this to find a card we want. Yeah, let's do um let's do Marauding Captain. We'll draw him next turn. We'll attack with this guy. And then we'll hit you for 16 hundos. No, not the quick play spell. I don't even know what it is. Scapegoat! That was face down for me. I couldn't tell what the hell was going on. Alright, so... We'll have to attack a scapegoat. This will actually prolong his survival. Or his death. Whatever. 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 Yeah, attack the yellow one. Like, it doesn't matter. So, scapegoats can't be tributed to tribute summon. So, it's fine for us. He can't attack, though, either. I don't want to check the field. Nobody ever wants to check the field. Except, like, actual Yu-Gi-Oh players, which I used to be one. It's fun. Tournaments were fun. They were, they were, like, local ones, but they were fun. Like, I never got to any of the higher level tournaments. I wasn't that good. I was just alright. Alright, so... We should... Because now I can special summon a level 4. This card is removed from play. Uh, that doesn't really matter here. Yeah. Face up. Um, oh, yeah, I don't want to do that yet. Do we want to tribute it to destroy that? Uh, I think I'm, like, fairly certain I can send this into that and they both die. I'm pretty sure- I'm pretty certain. Let's see. Yeah, okay, good. That does what, yeah, that's what happened. I didn't want to ram it in there and then have it not work and then be like, Well, now I gotta kill this somehow. I also want to save Exiled Forces. I don't really want to get rid of it yet. I want to save it because I know that Atticus has dangerous cards in his deck. Winged whatever. Roy knows. Rhinos. Rhinos. Alright. End phase. Alright, so Swords Are Revealing Light's gonna end at the end of his next turn. So we gotta be ready for that. Trap Hole. It's a really good draw, actually. Um. I think maybe this is the turn we get rid of Field Commander, right? Roz. So let's do that. Let's get rid of him. Summon this guy. Don't activate his effect. Then we'll ram him. Hmm. Interesting proposition. We could hit him in the face for 5,000. Or we could just clear the board, hit him for 2,700. Uh, he'd be hit for 3,200 actually. But if I if I hit him for 5,000, he's set up for lethal next turn. And since I have Trap Hole, he doesn't have any spells on the board, and I have Exile of Force. I think... Oh, no, I can't. Okay. I've been playing too much Hearthstone, dude. I've been playing way too much Hearthstone. Because I just assumed we could go by him and attack directly. I love Hearthstone. Hearthstone's so fun. Yu-Gi-Oh is fun too, but like, I've been playing way too much Hearthstone. Just because I have it on my phone and I can play it when I'm in public not doing anything. <laughs> when I probably should be doing something. The time most people do. When you're procrastinating. That's Heavy Storm. I saw it for the split second you could actually see it. <sighs> Swords are revealing light ends early. That's terrible actually. Uh, I mean, actually, it's not that bad. What? Okay. 
Okay. Well, he gained that little bit of damage. It won't do much, but it actually saved him for one, one turn. But Freed's going to give me... Alright, he's at 4,800. Hold on. I have Freed, and I have 1,500 damage. No, I only have 1,000 because they got rid of my kunai. So that's 3,300. I need 1,500 to win this turn. So X-Saber, I win. <laughs> X-Saber wins me the game. Alright. There we go. Right off the bat. Alright, that should be a win. Unless I miscalculated, but I don't think I did. 2800, yeah, that should be 50, 5100 damage. Yep. Alright, good game, good game, that was fun. That was really quick. Ten turns long. Alright. Only 506 DP, though. And you know, actually, I, um, I got very, I actually confused myself, because I thought that when I was talking about him, and I was like, man, strongest guy in the game right here. I was thinking of Zane, who is actually literally one of the strongest guys in the game. Somebody told me to go back to the lab, but, like, I already did all the shit there is to do in the lab, and I don't want to rent out cards, because I just don't like doing that. I just don't like renting cards, it's not fun. Elemental Mistress. I don't think we can actually go in. It doesn't hurt to get some cards, though. Hey, it's these two. Tag Duel? Let's... Let's Tag Duel. We haven't... We haven't done any dueling in a while. Let's do a Tag Duel just to get used to it again. The more DP we can get, the more sandwiches we can buy Jaden, and the more card packs we can draw. So the further we can progress. So let's just duel. Fuck. I mean, yeah. I mean, in a tag duel, that just means that I'm not gonna go for a while, but Jaden should be able to respond. Uh, I just don't- I just don't think my deck's very good at responding. Like, I don't think that when- when they play a card, my deck's just like, Oh, I got- I got this. I got this, I can do this. Like, I don't think that my deck can do that very well. But I know that some decks are, like, Hold on. I was actually behind the mic just then. <laughs> I know that some mics are like specialized in doing that. Mine just mine just isn't. I just not the sort of deck I built. Of course turn one I get the more <laughs> I get the like what? Everyone has to do it? Dude, that's bullshit. Why the hell did I have to do it? It's not even my turn, right off the bat. Dude. That's actually really dumb that I had to do it, but... Luckily, I think Jaden should be able to respond pretty well. I had such a good responding hand. Mystical Space Typhoon. That's Monster Reborn, I think. No, it's Premature Burial. What card did he do? Exit of course. Alright. Probably gonna use it to get rid of a card. Mystical Space Typhoon. Fuck. I really wish I could see what these cards were. Stratos. Neos Pathfinder. So he's gonna get Neospace. Alright. We have a Neo Space. Whoa, we're in Neo Space. Oh goodness. His eyes changed color. Alright. Torrential Tribute. Well, wasn't that a fucking really good turn one opening play for Master Phoenix? That was an amazing play. Alright, I'm, I'm really actually grateful that he set the, uh, Mystical Space Typhoon for me, because that gives me a little bit of reaction. But we are gonna take, uh, 
a thousand damage. Unless she can man it. Nah, it's just a thousand damage. Fifteen hundred. Wait, what? Okay, I guess it counts itself in that. The thing is here, I can't use Sogan because I can't allow Jaden's Neospace to get deleted. Like, I don't think I can allow that to happen right now. I can play sort of Deep-Seated Hatred alongside, like... Uh, I don't want to play it alongside that. I can play it alongside a Future Samurai. And then I can equip it. Okay, I guess he's gonna tribute... Okay. She. I'm sorry. No use using Mystical Space Typhoon. I don't want it at the top of my deck. I'm not gonna use Mystical Space Typhoon. Well, they're very good at controlling the board. We actually... Some people do have the ability to just kill us in one turn, and that might happen here. There's no point. 1400. Alright, well, we're down to 4300. I'm still not gonna use it. <laughs> okay. This is gonna be a tough game. Aster's pretty good. I think he's pretty difficult to beat. Wow, it's the first time we've actually managed to summon. No, never mind. We are we weren't able to summon. We haven't been able to summon a monster all game. <laughs> Alright, maybe now we can actually summon a monster. There we go. Is that fine? Or is it gonna get deleted from existence again? Because that seems to be happening a lot. Like it just doesn't they just don't let us summon things. <laughs> They're so good, dude. <laughs> the fuck? Why are you doing that thing you down? Why did you do that? Oh. And special summon? Oh. I feel like they're getting the bird back. Okay, well. We got our bird back. I got sort of deep-seated hatred. <laughs> I love sort of deep-seated hatred. Um. Alright, well. I want to play Hayabusa Knight because we need to start getting board control, and I'm also gonna just fucking use Mystical Space Typhoon because I don't want that card to fuck us ever. I don't want it to ever exist. What was it? Good. Good. I'm glad that's gone. Alright, so we can first use, we can use this, we can use Neosalius to destroy the Winged Beast. And then, after that, we can use Hayabusa Knight to destroy that. And then we can use Hayabusa Knight to do 1500. This puts us in a position where we're able to do damage, and we have full board control. But, I think that the way their decks are built, they can really easily react here. And it's gonna be difficult. <laughs> because Aster's about to fuck us, I can see it in that animation. Oh my god, it's gonna be a normal spell card, I'm willing to bet. It was! And it's terraforming, so Neospace is gonna go away. Oh, but what if Mindy- if Mindy activates it? If it activates off of Mindy? Oh well. Yeah. If it activates off of Mindy, that's actually really good, because she probably doesn't have- She might not have a field spell- nah, she probably does. She plays Wind Monsters, so she might have, um... Fairy's Hunting Ground? Or Harpy's Hunting Ground? Uh, I don't know, man. It's gonna be difficult. Alright, let's see. I'm, like, almost certain, yeah, she does have Harpy's Hunting Ground. She plays Wind Monsters, so, like... Uh, yeah. She plays Wind Monsters, so it's, like, it's... It can only be assumed that she would have that. Ugh. Well, I can play Sog in here. 
if I- I'm not gonna surrender the game. <laughs> if I play Sologan- I'm gonna play Sologan to get rid of Harpy's Hunting Ground. And then Neos, Neos actually does get a benefit from it. We'll also play Command Knight. Alright. We got rid of whatever the hell that was. And we'll do 3100. Fuck, please don't be Mirror Force. I don't know what that is. Fuck, dude. I can't replay that shit. <laughs> oh no, this is terrible. And he's Destiny Drawing. <laughs> this is really bad, dude. <laughs> okay. Wait, well, all right. There, Jaden, pull a miracle out. You do this a lot on the show. Of course, he gets the sword of deep sea to take trip. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're just gonna attack. Like, honestly, there's not much else to do. I mean, I can summon Neos next turn, but. Those skull cards and those set down cards, space down cards, they scare me. Okay, well he's gonna summon, she's gonna summon that. What's it gonna do though? Oh, it's special summon from the graveyard because she gets to draw too. Oh no. This is all happening during the standby phases. Oh, fuck, Monster Reborn. Neosalius. Oh, this is terrible. Yeah, this is really bad. It's a warrior, so it gets a buff. Okay. Oh man, that's bad. Well, it can't attack Command Knight, which is good. I could attack that, though, which isn't good. It's kind of the opposite of good. I don't know if you know what that word is. <sighs> Alright, so we're returning alive. If I... Okay. What can we get from Warrior returning alive that would win us this game? I mean, look. If we take back Hayabusa Knight, it becomes a... It gains, what, 100 from this? No, okay, it gains 200 from that. It gains 400 from that. It becomes 1600. That'd be 1600. Ah, oh, but we can't kill that. So is there a card in there that could? Mm. Stratos? Would Stratos become strong enough? I think that's 2100. It's 2100. It no way, yeah, it would. Because Stratos would become stronger than that due to having a... It would, um... Or we could exile knights. Mm. If we exiled knights... This. If we exiled knights that... It's not a huge advantage, but I think... I think if we got Stratos out? No, wait, would Stra- yeah, Stratos would be it, yeah. Or do we want- let's take... I don't want him to do that. Or do I? Okay, well- alright. So we'll do- we'll take Stratos. We'll take Stratos, we'll summon Stratos. So let's play Stratos. Right? And then we get a choice. That's Spell or Traps on the field, yeah. We don't have any of those. So we'll just do this, I guess. So we'll add Neos to the, to the hand. Which, I, I don't know why, but I did it. Alright, so now we can destroy... His Neos, her Neos, whatever, their Neos. 
he, she, it's Neos. So that's gone. And then we can destroy that. D counter. Destroy the attacking monster. I mean, that's bad, but... Hey, at least we kind of turned it around a little bit. We turned it a bit more in our control. And all he's going to do is pass the turn. Heavy Storm. I fucking love Heavy Storm, dude. Okay. What is Undertake Control? Hold on. I want to know what this card does. Convert Contract. I want to know what this card does, Jaden. When you control no monsters, someone near- Fucking hell. I'll figure it out later. I think it said, like, you can summon a Neo Spaceman or some shit. Oh no, you just... You summon one from your hand and one from your deck and then you draw two cards and that's weird and I don't think I wanted to do that. Oh my god, she can't actually use Harpy's Pet Dragon to do anything, dude. <laughs> ah, I'm in a predicament, though. I can't do anything. Um... Is that a beast? No, it's not. Oh my god, it doesn't get affected by Sogan. Alright, Sogan, Sogan, Soggy. Soggy Waffles, I don't know. So, we'll play him. They both have 2,000, right? What if we sacked this? What if we sacked this and ran in with Stratos? Let's do that. I don't know. That face down card scares me, but I don't. If it activated on an attack, it would have activated already. So let's just do that. Place him at 400, and then see if we can win next turn. You know, interesting thing. Don't know what happened. I don't know how drawing out of cards works in tag duels. I guess if one person draws out and they try to draw, then you lose. How do you have in your deck? What is that? Why would you just attack right off the bat? What is? Why would you do that? That doesn't make sense. Anyway, you can play this. Well, I guess I guess you can. All right, that's a warrior, so that gets affected by the. Not spell damage. <laughs> Too much press there. <sighs> Heavy storm it next time, please, dude. And Sogan goes away. Jaden, can you not just listen and heavy storm shit, alright? Do we win the game? Ah, yeah, we do. We do. We win the game. Neos goes away. Neos won the game, because he died for it. Go, Neos. Let's also just get a little bit of DP out of this by doing a little bit more damage. Oh, I don't want to see the details, I really don't care. By doing a little bit more damage, we can get a little bit more DP out of it, so let's do that. It's not always we get to actually do this, so... Alright, we'll kill him 1,000 over. Alright. Well, we won that game. All thanks to a lucky lightning vortex. <laughs> Honest, that's why we won. Well, we might have won if I didn't draw that, but that won us that game right there and then. Man, that was a tough fight. All right. So, thank you all very much for watching. As I said at the very beginning of this video, if you do want to know why exactly these haven't been uploaded as recently, um, go check out that the uh, update video that should have been placed before this. If it's not, then I'm an idiot and it will be placed after this, so please be sure to check that out. Um, hope you guys are still enjoying this series. Uh, I know a lot of people were before and I hope to see those people back again. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.